Uh, it should be a special night at a sixth form college in Ipswich. Uh, the top badminton players in England are in action. They're playing an exhibition match with some of the local rising stars. Raj Youssef and Fontaine Chapman train at the home of English badminton in Milton Keynes. Let's go to Ipswich now and Tom Williams. Tom. Yeah, thanks very much. It's Rio and the Olympics this summer. Tonight it's Ipswich and the Performance Centre here, as you can see behind me, England's finest, Raj and Fontaine, just knocking up with two of the best players at this Performance Centre, uh, Katie and Levi. Uh, no doubt be putting them through their paces there. That looks great. Let's have a, grab a quick word with the head coach here, Mark. Um, the centre's been running five years or so. Uh, are you yeah. starting to see some results? Yeah, as you can see, it's thriving here now. And uh, today I'm pleased to announce that for the first time ever, we've got four players ranked in the top. 10 in their age group in England so it's just fantastic news. Well that's great news yeah well let's uh, go and uh, interrupt the warm up yeah, here and see if we can speak to two of the stars uh, Raj and Fontaine. We'll try not to get hit and uh, this is uh, one of two performance centres in the East. Uh, Raj how important are performance centres like these? I think they're very important um, they're like it's great to be producing the young talent and uh, trying to nurture them through and for me I know I started in a centre very much like this so yeah I think it's key for the development in the country. The other performance centre in the East uh, is in Luton. Uh, yeah, what sort of work have you seen from centres like these, Fontaine? Yeah, it's great. I mean, I was the same as Raja came from a performance centre and, you know, they really help nurture through the younger talent that we've got in the country. And it's really important that, you know, there's as many people come into these centres as possible because, um, you know, it makes makes us work a little bit hard as well, <laughs> knowing that there's some, some younger ones coming after us. Well, these are the stars of now. Let's speak to two of the stars of the future, Katie and Levi. I think just bring you to the net, you two. Uh, what's it been like playing with these guys, uh, Levi? Uh, it's a great opportunity to play both Raj and Fontaine. Yeah. Any tips so far, Katie? Uh, I don't know. It's just a really good experience and I've just really enjoyed it. Uh, Raj is uh, off to the Olympics uh, this summer. Just a, a quick thought on the Olympics, Raj, uh, in, in Rio. Um, what are your hopes going now? Uh, yeah, for me it's uh, my second Olympics, so yeah, I'm excited to be going to Rio uh, and yeah, I'm just really looking forward to it, uh, just sort of try and play as best I can and uh, try and uh, do Great Britain proud. Great stuff. Well, thanks ever so much for joining us on Look East this evening. Really exciting time for badminton in this region with the Suffolk Saxons entering the National Badminton League this year. It's a competition that Fontaine won uh, with Birmingham very recently and from what I've seen tonight, uh, we're in, very much in safe hands for the future. Tom, thank you very much.